Welcome to the programme. I, I suppose we're hearing some small numbers and I can't help but remember back to the start of 2020 when we heard about this small virus that was going around in China. It felt very far away and then suddenly there was one case and then five cases and then 10 cases in the UK. We're now hearing that there's around nine cases of monkeypox, but I suppose it's a very different virus to COVID. Uh, what should, should we be worried and how transmissible is it? No, we shouldn't be worried because it is not very transmissible. You have to have very close contact either with an animal, because this is a virus that lives naturally, probably in rodents in, in, in Central and Western Africa, uh, and it can spread from person to person, but only after very close contact. Now, I have to put a caveat on that. We've we don't know really as much, well, we don't know much, as much as we would like about monkeypox because it's a rare disease. And if it's a rare disease, well, the amount of information we have is, is very limited. It, one of its characteristics is um, it, it's different from smallpox in that the rash is different. And certainly all the cases that have occurred outside of Africa, none of them have been fatal. So that's really very different from smallpox, where you had about 20 to 30 percent mortality in smallpox that occurred, you know, in, in countries like the UK. So it's a much milder virus. People feel quite sick with it. Uh, but but this very close contact is, is um, seen to be essential. But having said that, the virus is evolving. It has got condor in Africa, and it's certainly spread out of Africa uh, at the moment. Um, there's there's um, basically the uh, initial epidemiology, which is not absolutely certain, but quite good, is that uh, men having sex with men is quite a good way of, of, of transmitting the virus, because clearly you have very, very close co physical contact. Mm. It's not a sexually transmitted disease, but very close contact. But it, it, it has a habit of springing surprises on us. And if that is the case, if it's the um, men having sex with men, as that's brand new for monkeypox, like the big outbreak they had in the United States in 2003, which was spread from pet prairie dogs. Somebody had imported rats from Ghana, where monkeypox doesn't naturally occur, but never mind. And they had infected pet prairie dogs in a, um, a, a pet supplies in Illinois. And that caused 47 cases in people who handled the prairie dogs. Now, none of those cases, none of those human cases spread the virus to anyone else. So this is a virus that's constantly, constantly springing surprises on us. And um, clearly, we'll have to wait and see. But, but, it's not like COVID. It's not going to spread on the rampage through the population. And um, as we've heard, it has a, the, the smallpox vaccine um, gives you about 85% protection if you need it. But basically, the only people who will need it are people who are looking after cases and people with very close personal contact with another case. They're the only people that we'd be recommending to have a vaccine. It's not the sort of thing where you suddenly surge out and vaccinate like we used to do against smallpox. Definitely not.